someone was serving beverages to customer and the water had passed through that tire first. And then she got three weeks before she was going to open, she wanted to come to training but had to cancel every time because she was too busy. Besides her at one training class, mm -hmm. three people, she had three employees there. Mm -hmm. I trained them. Four weeks later, yes, she so called me and said, All three, you don't have I've lost all three of my original baristas. Nice. I never really got trained. Oh, no. We have no idea what we're doing. Oh, no. Yeah. So then I had to come out and train her again. And finally, she came with some training classes here. So, but she went to one of the five or six. Y justo te iba a llamar hoy día que llegué para decirte. ¿Me entiendes? Eso es interesante. había cuantos diferentes ¿sí? Sí, no está muy cogido ese rey. Claro, por eso le decía. Ah. Eso tendría como que haber unos 15 días que lo pusimos así. ¿Ah, sí? Pero si se agarra, ¿no? Esos son los cogidos de mayoría por el centro que hizo don Roberto. Ajá. La mayoría es cogido de ya. El tierra sí está suave, todavía no se enraizan bien. Los de abajo tienen ya más de un mes ya. Ok. uno por allá, otro lo dice por acá para que veas. Sí. La Here we are in uh, Santa Rosa de Mindo, the property of Gracia Flores and uh, Roberto Nicolalde, beginning a, a natural regeneration or assisted generation habitat recuperation process with these trees from Tiny Footprint Coffee, paid for by Tiny Footprint Coffee. These are native plants made on this farm from this farm that are going to become native forest here in a short while. They grow next to the the alders that help uh, fix nitrogen in the soil, help uh, re recover the soil quality a little bit while the plants grow. Um, our calculations indicate that in a hectare or two and a half acres of, of land space, we're over a 20 year offset period uh, capturing 400 metric tons of CO2 emissions. So here within a reforestation area, we make a little uh, a seed bed where we've brought forest soil, living soil from the forest that's full of seeds and also with its own f fertilizer and, and growing mix of, of tree leaves and you get the idea. Here we're going to have plants growing. Throughout the next year or two, we'll transplant some, we'll leave some here and we, it helps us make a biodiverse forest analogous to the forest next door or where we brought the, the seed from. Um, so when we 
planting physically with the little black nursery bags, five or six species, within a five year period, we're gonna have 20, 30, 40 species growing here. Um, and over a 20 year offset period, a very biodiverse cloud forest.